After you finish your design, you will likely need to share it with others. A drawing layout organizes one or more views of your design on a virtual sheet of paper. A layout usually contains a title block, one or more viewports, and annotation. Let's take a look at the steps for creating a layout. The number of layouts in your drawing depends on the template you used to create the drawing. You can edit existing layouts or create new ones. I'm going to create a new layout by right-clicking one of the existing layout tabs and choosing the New Layout command. All new layouts include a default page setup and viewport. The viewport controls which area of the design to show and at which scale. For this layout, I'm going to show you how to edit the page setup, insert a title block, and create your own viewport. So I'll start by erasing the default viewport. I use the Page Setup Manager to change the layout's output device and paper size. Now I'm ready to insert my title block. I make the title block layer current and then I use the insert command to insert a title block drawing I created earlier. Next I'll define a viewport to display my design. I make the viewports layer current And then I create a new viewport and size it to fit into my title block. I can change the scale at which my design is displayed by selecting the viewport and then choosing an appropriate scale from the list of predefined options. Once my layout is ready, I choose the Plot command. In the Plot dialog box, notice the arrow in the bottom right corner which displays additional options. In this case, I'll accept the default settings and choose Preview to get a better idea of how my plot will look. Finally, I click the Plot button to send my layout to the output device. 